Good day, Christian friends. Today, I'd like to encourage your hearts from the book of James with the theme, Work Your Faith. Now, the mission of James was similar to that of a piano tuner, and I sure do know a lot about that. The tuner seeks to obtain perfect harmony with each key, and it begins with the middle C. That middle C is the standard of sound for, for tuning the, you know, the piano. And when the correct sound is established, all other keys are tuned in relation to the middle C. In the same way, James has established our middle C. It could then be sung harmoniously, faith without works is dead. James chapter 2 and 26. One thing James encourages us with that is the fact that faith and works go hand in hand. James pleaded with us to, to exercise our faith. Let our faith not just be in words, but to put it in action. As Abraham did, we, you know, we dare not settle by merely just, just giving, you know, our, 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 our pledge by words. But we ought to put our faith in action. Have you come to the point of genuine faith in Christ? Is there evidence of true work of Christ in your life? Are you tuned to the middle C? Here are some questions we can ask ourselves as we examine our faith. Was there a time when we realized that we're a sinner and in need of a savior? Has there truly been a change in our lives? Are we making an effort to grow in the things of the Lord? Do we have a desire to share Christ with others? And do we enjoy fellowship of God with other people of Christian faith? And if we can answer yes to these questions, we must move on with our lives as a life of faith, taking it to the street and acting in kindness and in service one to another. Jesus reminded his disciples and the people that if you've done it unto the least of these, whatever you've done to others to help and to serve, you've done it unto him. You've done it in his name. So what will you do individually? What will you do collectively with others to share your faith, to put your faith to work? Remember, faith without works is dead. Put your faith to work. May God bless you.